In the early 1900s, a dark shadow fell over a rural town in America. Shortly after, a married couple mysteriously vanished. The man's name was George. The woman's name was Maria. Two years later, George returned home but never told anyone where he had been or what he had done. Instead, he deeply immersed himself in a strange research. As for his wife, Maria, she never returned. 1988, outside the town of Mother's Day. Hello guys and welcome to TGN the Game Nerd the Shore. I talk about our play games that today we're going to be playing Mother. This is the... It's a prequel to Earthbound. It came out first, though, in 1989. And, yeah, I'm just excited to play it. It's really fun. I'm playing a fan translation of the Game Boy Advance version because the fan translation has this thing called the Easy Ring. And when you put it on, it makes the game a bit easier. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and begin. Just a quick rundown. Talk, you talk to people, check, you check an object. PSI, I'll get into that later, and goods, that's just your items. Without further ado, let's begin. Suddenly, what's this? A lamp attacks us. So yeah, this game is a bit wacky and weird right off the bat. That, by the way, the green thing that says smash, it's just called a smash attack because randomly you can get an attack that does a bit more damage. I think there's some sort of statistic thing, but I'm too lazy to look it up. So right here we have a sister, her name is Minnie. Brother, I'm so scared, my lamp suddenly started going crazy. So yeah, for some reason the lamps all around the house seem to be going haywire. Get it? Haywire? Because lamps. And Plugging it in. Let's just fight the lamp. I'm... I suck. <laughs> so yeah, this is basically just what combat is gonna be for the next little bit. This game is really tough if you play the NES version, because there's no easy ring in that one. Uh, it's, it's just a really tough game, and that's why the fan translator put in the easy ring. Not to say... I say fan translator, but the person who translated it is actually, I'm pretty sure they're a professional translator for stuff. Anyways, we have another sister named Mimi, help, and her doll is attacking instead of the lamp. I feel like there's a pun here, but I can't come up with it. If I can think of one, then I'll put it in post. I'll edit in some text. Also, while we're fighting this doll, I recently started doing YouTube shorts, which I'll get into in a little bit. But yeah, they're just little clips where, from each point of the video, I'm just like, I just show off a bit where I'm like, hey, this was a cool point of the video. I'm actually recording right before I'm about to post another short. Oh, and by the way, we beat the doll and we're leveling up. Fight went up by two. Speed went up by two. Wisdom went up by three. Strength went up by 3. Force went up by 3. Max HP went up by 4. Max PP went up by 4. And we level up again! So yeah, the easy ring is really useful when it comes to playing through the game. Speed went up by 3, wasn't went up by 2. Strength went up by 3. Force went up by 3. Max HP went up by 2. Max PP went up by 3. Nintendo learned a new PSI in battle. So PSI is basically a mysterious ph phenomenon stop. But PSI is basically just a thing you use to... It's basically psychic powers. Because, like, PSI, Psy, Kick... You, you get it. Oof, that was scary. Oh, I think I see something inside the doll. There's an old music box hidden inside the doll. Nintendo opened the music box. A broken melody began to play. And 10 learned the melody. So yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. That's that's our main goal in this is to get the eight melodies. So technically speaking, we're already an eighth of the way through the game. Also, a fun little thing is if you go back into Minnie's room after uh, co defeating the doll, if you talk to her, here's some juice, big brother. 
you must be pretty thirsty. And you can just keep talking to her, uh, and it'll just keep happening over and over. Looks like you can't carry in any more items. I'll go ahead and chug some orange juice. Tell me down in the comments below, what's your favorite juice? Orange juice or apple juice? I personally like apple juice a bit more, but uh, orange juice is still really good. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and head downstairs. My sentence was a bit redundant there, but we have our mom right here. Are you okay, Nintendo? What on earth is happening to our home? I'm so scared. If only your father were here now. Oh, the phone! Could you get it, Ninten? Ninten picked up the telephone. Ninten, it's your dad. Oh. Hmm, I see. Sounds like it must be a poltergeist of some sort. I'm not sure what to do about it either. But your great-grandfather did study PSI at one point. Perhaps there's something in the basement that can ma help make sense of things. I, I know I put the basement key somewhere, but I can't remember where. Anyways, you're our only hope. Now's the time for an adventure. Go forth, Ninten. Protect us all. So yeah, now we can leave the house. This cool little tune plays, one of my favorite songs in this game. Uh, right here we have our pet dog. You understand animal talk, right? Then I'll give you the hint. Try checking me. So yeah, Ninten here, that's our main character's name by the way, Ninten. You've probably already seen it. Uh, but we can talk to animals. And I think that's a theme throughout the series, I don't know. Because yeah, this is a series with three games. And... Yeah, it's just a really good series. A key to the basement is hanging from the dog's collar. Nintendo took the basement key. So yeah, we got the basement key now. We can head over here. It's locked. Have to go ahead and go to our goods, use the basement key. Spooky. Nintendo opened the present. Found Great Grandfather's Diary. In the present found the cracked bat. So this is our first weapon. It's a pretty basic weapon, uh, doesn't do too much extra damage, but it's still good to have. Found bread. Nintendo took the bread. So yeah, now we have some food. And our first real enemy is the rat. Go ahead and do 8 damage. We took 1 damage. So yeah, there are rats in the basement, so I want to get out of here as soon as possible. New PSI in battle, sick. Uh, life up alpha, that's basically just your basic healing move. But anyways, that's where we're gonna go ahead and end off the video. Next time, we're gonna go ahead and leave our house and just see what we can do. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye